Hey guys, welcome back to a, another vlog. I just got home from work and I'm about to do my workout. I did a booty day yesterday and so obviously my glutes are really sore. So I decided not to do my shoulder day because I do hit with that one. So I'm doing chest and tries. So I have my weights ready to go. But before I do that, I am going to prep some veggies so that it's ready to go basically when I'm done my workout because I'm hungry. Okay, so I prep a ton of sweet potatoes for the week on Saturdays, which is usually when I make my waffles as well. So it's really nice to just throw them on a pan. I put olive oil and paprika and pink Himalayan salt on it. That's it. Then I bake it at 425 for about 22 to 23 minutes. I know that's random, but it's just the way my oven makes them perfectly. And then I'm going to chop up some zucchini and throw that in at 425 as well for maybe 25 minutes. Now I'm gonna wait for it to preheat, start working out and throw it in the oven and enjoy this when I'm done. My house is freezing. I'm literally wearing socks <laughs> through this workout unless I get warm. But I'm gonna do this and I'm gonna look so cool. <laughs> I am done my workout. That felt so good. When we were on vacation, I still worked out every day. Once a week, I would have a rest day as usual, but for the most part, I was very consistent with my workouts. That was really nice to get back into weights. I missed my weights so much. I used bands, which is still great. I love bands, but I also really miss my weights because I love weight training. <laughs> I am tired but I'm really proud of myself for pushing hard and feel more accomplished when I work out and puts me in a better mood. It's more than just physical, completely more than just physical. It's helped me get through some really tough days. There's been workouts where you just crush it and then there's workouts where you're crying because you're having a tough day and you don't feel like you can get through it, but you push yourself through it and it's just something that it's hard to explain, you just overcome something so challenging um, mentally and physically and I think that's just amazing. So that's my ramble for today and I think my food is almost ready. Here's my food, it's literally a plate full of veggies, yum. So I usually like to eat my sweet potatoes and get some protein like a salad or something after. So I ate my food after my workout. I can't remember where I left off. Um, I was a bit distracted because my husband actually came home. I am going to prep some veggies. I think I'm gonna prep some carrots. I Like I love my veggies cooked. Um, it's a lot easier on my digestion and I just think it tastes better. So I'm gonna cook some carrots and probably some broccoli. 
I absolutely love broccoli, but I have to be careful with my portions and how often I eat it because it can get inflammatory for me. Like I will get joint pain in my knees, I will feel it, and my stomach just bloats. So I have to be careful, but it's so good for you and I just love it. So basically, I'm sure you guys have seen this in my other videos. Oops. But I honestly just squeeze a bunch of lemons, put it in a jar, and every morning I have lemon ginger water. I try to do that every morning when I wake up before I eat anything, I make sure to have a full bottle of this, plus a cup of lemon ginger water. Besides that, I think we don't have much going on, except my husband actually won some tickets to a hockey game in our area. And so sometimes we like to do that as dates. That was actually our first date when back in high school. <laughs> Okay, so most of that is good to go. I cleaned up and now I'm just waiting for my food to be done in the oven. Now, I haven't made broccoli in a while and oh, it just stinks up your house so bad. <laughs> Tastes so good, smells terrible. While Ken is gone, I am going to put in some oils in the diffuser, specifically purification it'll take away all the stinky smells. So I should do that now so that when he gets home, it's hopefully cleared up and gone. So I made a video on unboxing this kit, but I think I'm going to do, so this is the purification, which there we go. Purification, I'm also going to do lemon as it just is bright and it smells nice and clean. Those are the two I'm going to use and hopefully, hopefully, this kicks in fast enough before he gets home because I don't know what time he's gonna be home. Voila! Veggies are done cooking. I mean, it doesn't look pretty. It's just prepped veggies. I should actually probably get ready and then we'll probably be leaving shortly after that. So that's my day for ya. You get to watch a lot of prepping. <laughs> Sorry if that's boring. It's freezing. Like outside in my house. <laughs> I am so cold. This is literally me spending time at home, cuddled in a blanket, in front of the heat dish. This is my life. <laughs> oh, I can't wait for spring, honestly. I can't wait. Also, it smells amazing in here, and I cannot smell the broccoli at all. So, once Kenzie gets home, I'm gonna ask him and see what he thinks. What does it smell like in here? Does it? Yeah. Do you smell broccoli? <laughs> you can't! That is cheating! I don't know, not really. Ah, oh, yes! Diffuser works. It does smell like broccoli. I smell nothing but broccoli. <laughs> that is a lie. Classic Danny doesn't end her clips. I just washed my hair and blow dried it and straightened it. And like, what is this? <laughs> Why does my hair do that all the time? Help a girl out because this is ridiculous. I try to put water, try to comb it, frizzy, help spray, I don't even know what I'm saying. <laughs> Some kind of frizz control spray that I have. Still is just, like, why does it do that? <laughs> I just wanted to end my vlog. We went to that hockey game. It was freezing. Minus 51, 52 degrees Celsius. But it was a lot of fun. So 
Anyways, that's what we did and then I got home and went to bed because I'm a grandma. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. I hope you guys have an amazing day and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.